Now, if you know anything about Troy Ave, you know he gonna bust that gun. Back with another motherfucking another one. Wait a minute. We not starting this right now. Where's my music at? There we go. Welcome to Rich House of Views, the realest motherfucker review show on the net, man. We here with some breaking news. Breaking news. How many of you guys know about an artist by the name of Troy Av? Troy Av. I'm going to be honest with you. He had a lot of heat early 2000s. A lot of heat. Um, you know, and I can't even cap, like, you know, two th- 2010s, he had a lot of heat as well. Uh, 2016, it was an incident, crazy incident at Irvin Plaza in New York. Uh, a lot of big names was in the building, T.R., you know, Uncle Murder, Casanova, all type of people. And let's just say at that situation, two, I think three people ended up shot. Now, in the situation, 2016... The, you know, apparently um, Troy Ave got into it. Troy Ave and his partner got into it with this guy named Tax Stone, which was a known podcaster on, online at the time. Once he got into it with that guy, they approached each other. In the midst of the fight, Tax Stone ended up shooting his friend. His friend ended up dying that night. Rest in peace to Bang. Um, his friend died that night. Uh, you know, Troy Ave grabbed the gun from him crazy fucking night you know you can look the video up online so in this whole crazy pandemonium you know Troy Ave got locked up he sat down for a while and you know the streets never really you know really hurt and it never really said much about a lot of people try to say he snitched but I don't think he snitched he literally didn't do nothing you know what I'm saying so I don't know you can look it up online that's public information I'm encouraging you guys to look it up nonetheless today I hear on his IG page that there was a shooting so apparently this is the third attempt on his life the first attempt would be that one at the urban plaza the second time will be christmas day when he would be chilling on ig gets off of ig post next thing you know he's in a uh, i think he was in a lambo or maserati that shit gets shot up um you know near death experience for a while he was on the low for a while and obviously he had a court shit going on so it's like it's not like this guy could just run around the whole city and do what he wanted to do he couldn't anyway nonetheless Troy Ave today, he mentions that there was another attempt on his life. He says God is great. Um, he has legal security. So apparently a shooting went down. This shooting that actually went down, um, somebody's dead. So whoever got a Troy Ave, this was not the right guy to get at. Whatever one of you decided to get a Troy Ave, playing with that boy from Brooklyn, like he just slouched. I don't think that was the right thing to do. Now, Obviously, you know, there are some people that don't like Troy Ave, and there are some people that don't like me and you. I don't think anybody deserves a threat on their life, and I do feel like, you know, you have the right to defend your life. You see, the your life or my life, I'd rather it be yours. Um, nonetheless, I really want to hear you guys opinion on this whole situation with Troy Ave. You know, you can go right to his IG page, he's talking about it right on there. And, you know, let me know what you guys think about in the comments. Uh, make sure you guys subscribe to my channel. I actually do a daytime show and a nighttime show on YouTube and Facebook where we review artists from all around the world. Producers, artists live on air, and I do trash artists. So I'm encouraging you guys to definitely tap in with us. Let us know what you think about this Troy Ave situation. Make sure you subscribe to Rich House of Views. Hit that top bell so you never miss a notification. Follow us on Facebook. Follow us on IG. Other than that, Shout out to the gang, and I'm going to get back to y'all with this Troy Ave update.